These are three of the cheapest cars to run on sale today. I'm here to see if these entry-level midgets are actually fit for purpose. Can they really get from A to B when A's here and B's there? The Hard Knot Pass, the Mount Everest of roads. Snaking through the Cumbrian countryside, this one mile stretch is the steepest road in Britain with a gradient of 30%. That's one in three in old money. To help me test which of our ordinary cars can get to the top of this extraordinary road the quickest, I've brought along three of my heftiest mates, just to get the cars really sweating. First up, the Proton Savvy. You can get one of these for a fiver short of six grand. It comes with a 1.2 litre engine. We're going to compare which car is the quickest to the summit using this very scientific stopwatch come kitchen clock tape to the dash thing. First gear, gonna give it hell. It's wheezy. <laughs> This is the most powerful car here, it's 75 horsepower. Oh, it pulls one well about four and a half thou. We're nearly at the summit, guys. Oh, right, really OK, good. that's it. 1,300 feet, we've reached the summit. So the Proton Savvy crosses the line in two minutes and 48 seconds. Next contender, please. The Hyundai Amica can be yours for less than five grand. On paper, the 1.1 engine makes the Proton seem like a ballistic missile. This Hyundai produces just 60 horsepower. This car handles a little bit better than the Savvy. It's slower than the Savvy. 0 to 62 takes 15 seconds, so one second slower. But we can do 40. Here we go, this is the big killer. I'm going to do it in second. Let's just do it in second. No, 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 maybe no let's, not. let's do it in first. <laughs> Okay, ready and stop the clock. Stop. What time was that then? Three minutes. That's not too bad. So, 12 seconds slower than the Proton, which leaves us with one last contender, the Oddball. This is a microcar MC2. It's built by a French company who usually use their fiberglass skills to make yachts. It costs £8,000, and while it only has a 500cc two-cylinder engine with just 21 horsepower, it weighs a mere 355 kilos, largely because it has just two seats. Sorry, fellas. Uh, see you at the summit. I didn't take it over 24 miles an hour on these little corners. Actually, quite nippy. It weighs probably less than me and Rod. <laughs> Oh, this is this is the really steep hill. Which gear are we in? I don't know because it's just in D. We're down to 11 miles an hour now. Okay, we're we're nearly there. We're nearly there. It took the MC2 nearly four minutes. A frankly charmless car that can be driven on a bike license, but when it comes to hills, you're better off in a Proton. Hang on, isn't that? That's the other. It is. 